Large gatherings remain an issue, with social distancing still required, particularly with the youth. Eyewitness News reporter Jasmine Allen spoke to law enforcement about the dangers of these gatherings to both your health and safety. Since mid-June, the Oneida County Sheriff's Office has gotten several reports of large gatherings of teens and young adults in remote areas. We've had them in the town of Sangerfield. We've had them in the town of Verona. We've had them reported to us in, in the town of Kirkland. Um, these are occurring either on um, remote state-owned lands or um, lands of, uh, you know, like farmland, obviously without the farmer's knowledge or consent. The information usually circulates on social media, so it's able to reach large volumes of people. One party had nearly 200 people attend. The partygoers engaged in a number of illegal activities, including underage drinking and assault. Some of them have been victims of crimes, um, you know, whether it's threatened with weapons or um, assaults or uh, personal property being stolen. Uh, some of the kids have reported their cars being broken into while they're at these parties. So we're getting the reports after the fact, you know. So again, it isn't even anything that we were able to intervene on while it was happening. Another major concern is the potential exposure to COVID-19. When you have 200 people together um, in close proximity or with each other at bonfires, you know, outside, um, obviously there's no social distancing, there's no precautions being taken. But we're also seeing in, in some neighboring counties around the state, they're seeing spikes in cases. For now, the sheriff's office is keeping a close eye on the hotspots, but there are many other remote locations perfect for partying in Oneida County. No exaggeration, there's probably hundreds of places like this that kids could gather, and no one's going to know about it unless someone at that party makes a call. If you notice an unusual amount of cars gathering in a rural area, or if you see that there's a large gathering of people that exceed the state's guidelines, then please call the sheriff's office, or you can leave an anonymous tip with Crime Stoppers. In Oneida County, Jasmine Allen, Eyewitness News.